Where did everybody go, Mike? Are we like late for the tournament? No, we're old and we know it's going to be there when we get there. See, I like my man's thinking because everybody's trying to get there. The ramp has what, six ramps? Eight. Eight ramps. Eight ramps. And people want to go sit in 30 degree weather for an hour and a half before the tournament. I don't get that. Winlet used to go and I used to say, hey, what are we doing here an hour before sitting in 30 degree weather? It's freezing cold, slight rain, everything else. I said, are we going to have a seance or what? I'd rather stay right here, eat some little bite muffins and enjoy myself in the nice warm weather. As you can tell, it's freezing out there. It's cold. Everybody in the house has done left. The bass, I'm sure, are going, Bleh. we're going to be going, Bleh. and I'm not looking, I'm, I know you guys saw my practice vlog, I'm not really excited about today. I am excited about this peanut butter and banana sandwich for breakfast. Mike and his little school lunch. Look at that. Aw, his little school lunch muffins. Aw. I may not catch one, so this may be all I can afford this week, so little bite muffins. Oh, that's so cute. His wife packed him school lunch. He, he, you got your little chocolate milk too? No, I didn't he, get any You got your little milk. chocolate milk no. too? All right. All right, guys, what's well, about to begin? You guys stay tuned. You get ready to see some raw footage of a man who had a horrible practice. Try to figure him out during the tournament. 125,000 on the line, and I got to figure this out during the day. My man Mike here is going to be stomping him. I don't advise you trying to find him during the day, but there's a lot of times that's what you have to do. But I didn't have a great practice either, but I did catch a few big ones, so hopefully. So put Mike on your fantasy, okay? Anytime there's grass, you got to put Mike Sermon on your fantasy. If I was voting fantasy, I'd have him number one. My man has won a lot of money. Nine boats. Nine boats in Florida. Maybe so, you never know, though. You guys stay tuned. Boat number. Boat 90. Boat 90. Check in time. 340. I forgot the type again. Oh, oh. Third. I can't catch with the camera going on. That's. I hope this. I hope this ain't a. I hope this ain't a sign of how I'm gonna fish today. <laughs> good luck. I think it's good luck. You didn't catch that, but you catch it. <laughs> Guys, I know. A lot of people take that song for granted, but I don't, and I appreciate all of you guys who have fought, who are gonna fight, and who have been there, servicemen and women who have put their lives at risk for us to have the freedom to come out here and do this. Like chill bumps right now, you guys are not forgotten. crazy is I this was a bonus fish I just threw out there in the middle of nowhere but as I was easing up I saw a bed that was really 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 clean and I didn't see a fish on it and I almost left and went away and guys whenever there's a difference in seeing beds that are kind of clean and then you see one really swept off well I saw that and I just came back made a wild cast out there caught this one and looked and that one's on the bed so we might be able to get two.
said it before, guys. <laughs> You've got to be observant in everything that you do. <laughs> <laughs> like that one right there i literally saw the grass move and you know paid off i mean that's a two year i'll take that one all day There's one. Oh yeah. Come on, get out of that grass. Get out of that grass. Oh yeah. Man, I love it. Get in here. Yes. <laughs> is doing the trick this morning i thought i would come in here and sight fish but i mean the wacky worm seems to be what's going on so anytime sometimes they don't move up on the bed they're they're just roaming around uh they're not on the bed yet you got females putting out, so I'm just randomly casting. And that makes three that I've caught in random casting, so uh, I think I'm on something. Practice hadn't this was the first day that I, I got actually got on some stuff. You know, this is where I had the best day, day one, and I figured the cold water would have them turned off. But as of right now, they don't seem to be mine in this cold weather. Oh my gosh, that is crazy. I set my pole down. Oh. I don't think he's 12. That's pretty funny. That is pretty funny. I actually heard my rod going to tink, tink. Ooh, oh my gosh. Oh, can you believe it? That's number four. <laughs> oh my gosh. Number four. Oh, you talk about a deep breath. I got a deep breath going on to know that I've got four in the live well. After a practice day. And I got four in the live well. Oh my gosh, I'm shaking. And that was just a 12 incher. Oh my gosh. All right, we just, we left that area where some spawners were at and we, you know, you see me catch the four. I spent about, 45 minutes on these docks right here just to give it a give it a whirl out here on the main lake so the only thing I know to do is is go to the community area of Spring Creek and I've practiced in there I had one bite is just to go back in that area and just drop the troll motor and I'm gonna just put myself where I think a lot of fish are at and just try to grind it out that's that's all I can do is just grind it out I mean it's like 11 o'clock now and I don't know my chest is hurting so I know it's tough the water's like 59 degrees and when we got here it was like 68 so the water temperature has dropped 10 degrees in the last few days so that's definitely put a shock on them but eh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna concede to these bass yet I'm gonna keep on after them.
can't ever catch really a fish that's just like plain and simple. That sucker will come off. Mm. Come on, baby. I know you only twill, but it'll be a pound. Yay! I did it! I got a limit! I got a limit! in the last little bit. Three bites. You can tell he's, a, look how black he is. He, he's been up there shallow for a long time. It's, he got a suntan. Thank you, Lord. Jeez. Oh, I do got it on there. All right. I didn't know if I had the camera on or not. That's pretty cool. Again, I was looking for a clean spot, and that spot over there was really, really clean. That bed. And thank goodness for power poles. That right there, my man, is a nice coal for sure. Oh yeah, I don't know which one that is. All right, guys, that was that was definitely at least a pound upgrade. You know, I've, I've ran into a few boats today and everybody either doesn't have anything or, you know, fishing's really tough. So the good thing about it is, even though I don't have much weight and my practice was horrible, I've been able to scrap up a few, of course, fish on the bed. That was, that was my very first one I would love to come back over here and just see a female sitting on that bed. That would be crazy, crazy, crazy good. This lake has got my number. First day, of course, it was okay, and then in the last two days of practice, I, I told my wife last night, I said, I truly am scared, and I haven't been scared <laughs> going into a tournament, you know, thinking I might not catch one, and that was my attitude. I haven't had that feeling in a long time, so to come away with five, yeah, I'm happy. We'll take it, man, for sure. I'm well, my day was not a good day, but my man Kyle here busted, what'd you have? 18 pounds, nine ounces. He's the big gun at the house that we're at. So, hey, let me let me see that, let, let me get a picture of that fish. So my day wasn't good, but we're about to get a really good day. As you can see, we got us a bunch of bass. Oh, I'm, I'm just kidding. 
they're not bass they're crappy we're getting ready to eat some crappy my man Lonnie here is getting ready to drop in the sweet potato and fries. fries. This man could cook. He he cooked us some prime rib showed his like yet, he yesterday, and uh, it was an unbelievable prime rib. These are some of the great day. That's some of the speckled perch he went out and caught this morning. So we're gonna end the day on a good note. For, at least for me Kyle he had a great day and he's going to even have a better day when he chows down on this so guys I appreciate you guys subscribing commenting day two is going to be coming up uh, next and hopefully I can come away with a comeback I need a comeback uh, this lake has got my number but the good thing is it's warming up it's getting better fishing should get better tomorrow I just gotta, I just gotta find them. I know that's sim I know that's easier said than done, but I do. I just gotta go out there and f figure out where they're moving in at and capitalize on it. So, without further ado, guys, you know my outro. I wish I had some outros to give you of other people, but here we go.